Hey guys, my name is Johnny, and just a warning, this is gonna be a little bit of a different video. <laughs> kind of weird, but it needed to be done, okay? I don't make the rules, I just follow them. So you probably read the title, and you're like, okay, first off, why? Second off, how? And let me tell you, I'd love to explain myself. So, in short, I am moving slash traveling to Guatemala in 10 days. <laughs> so what that means is that I have to clean out my apartment, move as little as I can back to my parents' house to keep if I need it for later, and then travel with my backpacks to Guatemala. So what I've been doing is really, really cleaning out the things that I own. A lot of old memory stuff that is just very sentimental but kind of worthless, you know what I mean? The things that you hoard, like the little pieces of paper that just don't really mean anything, but you have them for years. Maybe like an art project from high school, which I did throw away. I had an art project from high school. I'm not an artist. <laughs> I don't know why I kept that, it wasn't good. I've been going through things and I found one of my favorite possessions, but I knew I couldn't keep it. And this is it. This is my favorite thing that I've kept from my travels. Maybe of anything that I've ever kept in my life, okay? This is it. And I'm Johnny. Why? And also, why? <laughs> Let me tell you. The year is 2016. I just graduated high school and I'm about to go to Spain out of the country for the first time by myself, ever, to live with one of my online friends and his family for a month. Very nerve-wracking, I've been practicing my Spanish for months. I'm ready to go, okay? I get there, and this little, little guy is in a welcoming bag from my friend's mom. I kept the bag for the longest time, I don't think I have that anymore, but, it was just a bottle of coke, like a nice little treat for a guest. It makes total sense. There's nothing really special about it. It's super sweet. But me, <laughs> I saw that it was all in Spanish and I've never seen a Coca-Cola bottle all in Spanish. Like, look. Incredible. Cree tu equipo. And Man, I... <laughs> of all the things that I've kept and cherished, why a bottle of Coke? Why did 18-year-old Johnny not only hold on to this, but bring it back, never open it, never use it? <sighs> Sometimes I love old me. <laughs> know what the hell I'm doing or thinking but anyway we love so back to my story I'm getting rid of things I do not want to get rid of this but why would I keep it it's a bottle of coke and also the bottle is so distorted and the coloring I don't know if you can see it but it's cool like it's getting light. This is not normal Coke anymore, okay? Like, I don't know what's wrong with her. Well, she's over four years old, that's what's wrong with her. But I wanted to try it. My plan right now is I wanna try it, just, just to try it. And then I wanna keep this little part of the label in my travel journal because I have Lots of little labels and stuff in there, and it'll fit in there fine, and then I can keep it and still remember that memory, because this is seriously one of my favorite things. I don't know why. <sighs> okay. I think now's as good a time as ever 
<laughs> I'm kind of nervous. Um, ooh, okay, hold on. I want to give you the nice ASMR experience. Let me, let me make sure. Let's see if there's any carbonation. All right, let's see. There was, n I don't know if you could, well, like, there's nothing to hear, but there was no carbonation in that at all. There was none. <laughs> and it kind of, the bottle just grew back with the air. Like now it looks normal. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Okay, listen, it smells like one of those Coca-Cola bottle candies. You know what I mean? Like it smells like, like Coke but kind of more sugary and flat, if that makes sense. Kinda smells bad. Okay, I can't think about it, I'm just gonna do it. Cheers. Salut. That is not Coke. <laughs> coke you've ever seen like you've had a two liter of coke open for a month and you go to take a swig doesn't doesn't fizzle you drink it it's it's flat coke you know what a flat coke tastes like but then put dirt and dust in it and then dilute it with some like sink water that's what i'm tasting here that's the cocktail we've had today Should I finish it? I feel like I have to finish it, right? <sighs> if you're gonna do something, you gotta do it right. We're finishing it, okay. Honestly, with the plastic, I'm probably gonna get sick from this. I can't wait to have diarrhea and throw up all day. I don't know, it does taste like those Coke candies. It really does. this point I can't remember why I'm doing this to myself but I'm <laughs> I'm still gonna do it <sighs> this is the last swig I'll let you know when I start feeling sick Worse. Oh my, my, my sorry, gurgling. This is a really bad decision for my body. <sighs> a great decision for the bit, though. Horrible for my body. Okay, here you have it. Oh my god, okay. Now I get to remove the label. I'll take it off and show you. You guys don't care about me peeling the label. There you have it. <laughs> Disgusting. I don't know who I am anymore. So that's what I'm keeping. I have the perfect page in my travel journal for this. The friend who I stayed with 
wrote me this page because I, I like to have people write in my travel journals because it's really nice to look back on. But yeah, so it's going <laughs> right here with the, the five year. <laughs> I will cherish her forever. So much better than keeping the bottle. I feel sick. Okay. So yeah, that was that was the entire point of the video was to drink an old thing of Coca-Cola. Anyways, if you want to subscribe or like this video, I would really appreciate it. It would make feeling horrible feel a little better. You know? So thank you. So pretty soon I want to kind of turn this channel more towards traveling just because I'm going to Guatemala by myself, a 23 year old female. <laughs> I'm only bringing a carry-on bag. I'm not going to check any luggage. I'm going to be uh, traveling very lightly and I am staying for free by working at a beach hostel. So if there's anything you want to know about that or videos you'd like to see, please tell me down below and I'll absolutely do them. I <laughs> am going to have a lot of free time on my hands, but keep your eyes out. I have a couple videos planned for before I leave, so make sure you subscribe and click the bell if you want to see those. Anyway, have a great day. See you.